Hello kids! Welcome to IP Storytime with your teacher, Teacher Lisa. And today I will tell you a story about a small mouse and a big bear and a lion. Okay kids, are you ready? Let's start! Once upon a time, there was a small mouse and the mouse was so sleepy. The mouse lived next to this big cave. Can you hear that? There is an animal in there that is snoring every day. It's Mr. Bear and Mr. Bear is snoring all winter long because he has his winter sleep. So the small mouse is so sad and sleepy. She goes to her friends to ask for help. The rabbit the giraffe and the monkey and she says what should I do I am so sleepy and sad then the monkey says why don't you ask the lion for help the king of the jungle he can roar so mr. bear will wake up from his sleep. The little mouse thinks. But she is scared of the lion. The lion is so big and powerful. So she thinks and she thinks and decides to give it a try. She's going to look for the lion. So the mouse finds the lion, but she's scared and she asks the lion for help. Mr. Lion, can you please help me? And the lion says, no, you're just so small and useless. Why should I help you? So the mouse walks away the mouse is still scared so scared of the big lion then the lion starts walking and the lion is uncomfortable and the lion starts itching he is so itchy what is going on he doesn't know what's happening and the mouse jumps on the lion because she can see these tiny fleas in his fur and she thinks I will help Mr. Lion and Mr. Lion is itching and itching because he has fleas and the little mouse catches a flea and takes it out of his fur. Then she catches another flea and takes it out of his fur. But the lion is still itching, itching and itching until the tiny small mouse has taken all the fleas out of his fur. And the lion says, Mouse, thank you so much. I shouldn't have called you useless. Thank you, my friend. Now, I will help you with your sleeping problem. And the small mouse and the lion go to the big cave. Then, one, two, three. The lion roars. And then one more time, 
the line worse again until Mr. Bear runs out of his cave. Ah, what's going on? I was asleep. You woke me up. Hmm, winter is over. It's summer now, so I should be awake. Thanks for waking me up. And the little mouse is so happy. She can finally go to sleep now without the snoring. And all the animals start laughing and everyone is happy. Okay kids, thank you so much for watching this story time and I will see you again next time. Bye!